Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Anna and my channel name is only in my dreams. Today everything is $1.25 honey. Yes, $1.25. Now if this is your first time visiting, I hope you enjoy your stay and if you do, press that subscribe button so you don't miss out any of the future videos. Now I'm going to share with you, I did a DIY, Dollar Tree DIY. I'm going to share with you what they look like if you like to go visit that video i'll link it down below and you can see how easily you can make this in your own home and these are just my door hangers that i created with the dollar tree items that i bought and some other little goodies i had here at home so you can actually decorate the front and the back and customize it whichever way that you want and somebody even even wrote down in a comment that was brilliant that her sister puts scent beads, the downy scent beads in here. So they give out a really nice fragrance. So there you go. If you'd like to learn how to make these, go check out that video. It's super easy DIY using the things that you have at home. And those are the fabrics that I got from the Dollar Tree actually that I hauled recently. So check those videos out too, okay? Um, I do have a Timu order coming to me today. Be on the lookout for a Timu haul this coming up shortly. And I do also have the Hannah Friendship Crafty Challenge. If you guys want to join the Hannah Friendship, I'll give you an idea of what it's about. It's 18 years and above, Canada, USA, open till the end of September the 30th. All you have to do is send me your Hannah Friendship where you trace your hand on some cardboard, some paper stock, anything that represents you. And I do have a video showing you examples of the hand, hand of friendships that I received back in 2019. And um, you can be entered to win a whole bunch of really cool crafty goodies, okay? There could be up to three winners depending upon how many hands I get in the mail. So do, go check out that video as well down below. <sighs> oh, that was a lot, honey. That was a lot. Oh, okay. Let's get into this. Foodie finds. Okay, we got some a couple of noodles, rice noodles here. I never seen this there before, but these are Thai yellow curry flavor. So this is a stir fry style rice with Asian noodles in sauce. I've never tried this. Um, I was immediately intrigued. They have a Best Buy date because I got two of them of eleven. 14 of 2023 and this again this is rice so if you enjoy a rice and you like your curry girl go get you some they have them there right now and this is name brand i know it's a good one to get i gonna put this here in my little box then in the checkout while i was checking out they didn't have this in a regular candy aisle it was behind like you know where they move the bags and they place the bags for you to take them. It was there. So this is the Kit Kat. I did get three so my boys can try it. This is the Kit, Kit Kat birthday cake. I've never seen the birthday cake there before. And I don't know. The best buy date for this is 8 of 2024. Wow. So technically speaking, you could buy these and tuck them away for a Christmas, a little Christmas sweet. You could do that or for somebody's birthday, a little birthday cake, Kit Kat. They're available right now. So I picked those up. I'm going to put them over here. Booyah! And I still have my sign up right here because I need to add some rope and something else to it. So I'm sitting there thinking about how I want to zhuzh that up. That was in my last haul, so I'm looking forward to that. Now, they just started putting out Halloween items, so I'm really excited to see what they're bringing out. And one of them were these glass bottles, and they have them in three different variations, and they come in a four-pack. And they come in this very dark, dark um, greenish amber color, and they do have the little, the little signs there, the little Halloween stickers with the little skull and crossbones, which is really cool. So I got that one. This is a four piece and I got the taller one. I didn't get the medium size. I just went for small and tall and they have the really cool stickers there in the front that vary. So those should get four different um, things there in the front. And I thought that maybe I could do a mixed media little room box using these Halloween theme. Yes, and yes. These, if you clean them out because they're dark amber, these might actually be good for some tinctures and what have you. I don't know about the cork, 
but you could seal up the cork with some wax as well. For those that make your own tinctures and you always need your dark amber glass bottles, think about it, okay? So they have these in three different styles. They only got two because I want to make some mixed media. And I do junk journals. I just did a um, plan with me uh, for August. And then I'm going to do the weekly for each week as well. So make sure you come for that. And, and I do other things. So be about it and be a part of it. Become part of the family. Okay? Join in. Stop what you're doing and subscribe, honey. Now, the next thing that I found was in the autumn department. They have the craft kit. And um, I got another one because... I, I only got one, but when I go visit my sister, so I bought another one. I want to take this so we can all sit down together and we can all make the little people together as a family because <laughs> we do stuff like this and we craft and we make wreaths and, you know, we do all kinds of kinds of things. But, you know, we, we always end up baking because she bakes with the boys and then we could do a little craft while something is baking, put our names on it, and then I can attach them to cards or some other kind of thing that I can use for my decorations. And, you know, something personalized is fun that we can do together. So I got another one. So one's for the kids, one's for the family when we get together. Then and then another little mechanical 3D puzzle bat kit is this one. And I thought it was really cool looking. Okay. And this does have... That's the puzzle so you're gonna have to punch those out it looks like all right and the instructions are inside but you also get all of this I guess you need these things to put them together maybe especially for this little box that looks like the little handles turn and stuff so you might need those little pieces right here that are included to make that so that's nice that they have everything so I picked out this one and I picked out this one because it looks like the wings actually move and the bat wings move too. So I know my twins are really going to enjoy this. Again, it does have the little pieces that you need in the back and then you just punch these out. I'm sure they could punch them out by themselves. No problem because my kids are old enough to do that. Um, but it looks like it's, it's two pieces, like two pieces of wood, two pieces of wood to punch, you know, worth of items to punch out. So this is a good one to have to keep them busy. Then um, I did find some lipsticks, some new lipsticks, and I'll swatch those for you. So give me a second. I'm almost there. They came out with the Halloween tree. Now, I don't know if they're going to have variances or if this is it. I don't know. But I'm really liking this one. And let's take her out so you can look at it. If you're into doing the little tree thing, um, the little home decor, you don't you don't go all out for Halloween. You just do a little table or a little tablescape on your dining room, add some cupcakes and candies. You know, you keep it light and keep it fun. Uh, this one is a combo of the black and the orange. So you just have to zhuzh this up obviously and you take your time doing it but just know if i stay here we're gonna be here all day if i'm sitting here as usual i just want to give you an idea okay i'm just giving you an idea and then you keep on you know extending these out it does have the little pieces here at the bottom that make it stand up okay you just slide those in and it makes it stand up you get three of these and just so you know it does have they did have the little what do you call them? The little skirts, the metal skirts that said three or four different variations in metal for Halloween. I didn't get them because I didn't know if I wanted them or not, but I'm thinking I might want one now. So if I go back and I find it, I'm going to get another one. But look how cute that tree is. And then you got to just keep on zhuzhing it up to, um, to make it work. Now with this, right next to it, they had four different variations of items that you can buy. Okay, let me put this over here for the tree so i got this one i got the orange they had it in purple they had it in black and then they had it in this really pretty orange that comes with the mats the shiny and the glitter and i thought that these are really cool it would be really cool to add add little black witch hats and what have you i did that one year i had little witch hats on my tree and it looks so whimsical and something else I had something else on it too and it looks so cool but i did buy these this year Okay, but if I go back, I think I'm going to buy that little metal skirt thing. 
I think I am. All right, so these are the four that I bought this time around. They're, they're brand new. And I also did buy the Yes to Avocado Hydrating Cream Mask. So they had that there as well. Got that too. So let's try this L'Oreal. Okay, so this one is L'Oreal. Let's pop this one open here. All right. And it says L'Oreal of Paris. And what color is this? Um, it's not really telling me a color. At least I can't read it. I can't read it. But it's this really pretty color right here. So let's see. Okay, I just broke the seal. Oh, did I get some on my nose? <laughs> it has this really cool looking lip wand here that kind of like perks up. And let's see what the color is going to... Ooh, that's pretty. Wow, that's really pretty. Let me... And I like the way this wand feels. That's very smooth. I wonder if this is going to be just a creamy or a matte. I have no idea, but I really like this color. Isn't that pretty? That would look really pretty what I got on today with this dress. This dress is from Shein. I did a try-on, a plus-size try-on. I'm a size 26, 28, you guys. I tried on this dress. If you guys want to go see this dress, I'll try to remember to put the Shein try-on um, for you so you can see the clothes I have picked out, okay? And I do have a package coming to me from Shein, which does have a few pieces of clothing, so I may be doing another try-on. Okay, so then this one... I don't know if it's the same. I don't know if it's the same one. It kind of looks the same, but it looks different. I don't want to open it up if it's the same. Do you guys think it looks the same or a little bit different? I don't know. I'm not going to open this one up because I think it might be the same. So, okay. So I got that one so far. This opened up these white ones. I've never had these white ones before. So this is kind of exciting. What's going on with this hunting? Yeah. Let's see. Clean and fresh tinted lip oil. Oh, so it's a lip oil by CoverGirl. All right. And uh, what color are you? Uh, what color? It's Swipe Ripe. <laughs> That's the name of it. Swipe Ripe. That's funny. Okay, so it's a tinted lip oil. It doesn't smell funny or does it? I feel like it has some kind of scent. But I have my fan on. I feel like it has some kind of scent. But like I said, I have my fan on in here. Or I'm going to melt. And I don't know. I just have to try it again. Okay, so it's a tinted lip oil. I'm trying to do it kind of splotchy. So that one's, it's like a pink. It's coming off a little bit more brown there. But it's like a pink. It's like a pink color. And it's pretty. It's a lip oil. Okay. Let me see if the other one has that, I think, a scent, I think. Because it's not a, like, in-your-face scent. So let me see if this is a little bit different. Okay. This one's called what? Bad Apple. Bad Apple. Again, this is a lip oil. Yeah, it's the same scent. But it's not, like, a fruity scent. There's definite scent to it, but I don't know if it's like a, oh, it's like bad or if it's just the scent that it, the product has. You know what I mean? You know what I mean. Okay. So that's bad apple. Again, it's kind of hard to see right here. They both look pink. They both look pink. They both look pink. There you go. So technically speaking, I should have just bought one, but I don't know about the scent. It definitely has a scent. I'm not going to use them personally. I'm not because it has a scent and I'm not trying to play around with my lips. But this first one here, no scent, no issues, and it's a L'Oreal. So these, I'm just going to, I'm going to toss these just safety first. <laughs> I don't want, I don't want my face breaking out with some kind of weird, weird rash or something. Um, but that's it. That's everything for this haul, you guys. I know I never do a Sunday haul, right? It's so weird. Well, thank you so much for coming by and go check out my videos for 
these little cushions that I created. Also the hand of friendship. Check out the Shein plus size try on. Like I said, I'm a size 26, 28. Check it out. I do have some more things headed my way and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.